Okay. Unfortunately, our planning preparation is disappearing rather rapidly. How long until we have more of this? I wonder how much doctrine they've researched already. Because I think we've actually been doing a pretty good job with our doctrine research. I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. Non-aggression pact request from the Dominion of India. Very well. Oh, in fact, if we take Boma, we take the port, which means I can ship in troops directly to here. That would be nice. How's Germany doing? I'll have a look in a minute. Oh yeah, of course, the Second World War started. I forgot about that. There we go. You guys, sail into there. You continue taking their ports, I think. Meanwhile, in Germany, Germany are pushing? Yeah, I think Germany are actually pushing, aren't they? No, they're not. Complete stalemate. I mean, most of Belgium has fallen, but Germany is actually holding them back now. Ottomans have declared we're on Cyprus. And we've taken Dockyard. Let's get some more convoys. Although I could actually start building my light cruisers. You know what? Let's let's do that. We have enough convoys for now. Build one more and then finish. And we'll add these to the... Flotter Continental. Which I should totally be renaming. In fact, let's do some renaming now. Now that we actually are in a position to fight stuff. So, first of all, we have the... Trodding Army. Was it Trodling? Sorry, Trodling. I have misspelt you on my list. Add the L. So we got you, the Trodling Army. And we have you, the Gaithan army. And we have you, who are just backups, so you don't need a name. Portugal Fleet 1, I'm just going to call subs because I'm unoriginal. And then the actual navy would be the Zort navy. This is port. And of course it took off the wrong thing. Ah, bear with me. Right, done. So, stuff has been named. Huzzah! Right, back onto it. Right, the French forces are starting to attack. This is good, because it's going to tie up a lot of the uh, Middle African up there. Cypriot uprising has begun, as expected. You're marching to there. I'm going to have you pushing forwards as well. In fact, once they have arrived, and that's going to be imminent, we're going to pull you oops, back to... There. And there we go, Academia Imperial. One of the great boons of investing in local talent all over our empire is that we can pull minds and efforts to bring Portugal united and ready up to standard in these trying times. Colonial war effort. As the German trespassers continue to violate our borders, we have no choice but to escalate the conflict further. That's only going to be a good thing, surely. Do I use the prescriber names for the units as well? No, just the armies. Alright, you guys have almost arrived. Right, we have a new thing here as well. It is still 38. I am already researching those. I think it's going to be motorized time. Did I get any more... Military industries, no. And in fact, I think it is now time for us to start importing some iron. And we will do it from... Where are you? Oh, Carlos Spain. Yeah, that works. 
give you some more factories you can build up. Support weapons too. Excellent. Um, do we need marines? We probably will need marines at some point. Fleet and being. Bit early. Bit early. Fighters. We'll get the fighters. I'm so sorry, Fiddler's Reach. I totally forgot to add you to my list. You will be added, and you will be the next thing that I name. Would I say that Kaiseraiki is better than Vanilla Hearts of Iron 4? Really? Is that even in question? Vanilla Hearts of Iron 4 is kind of poor. I mean, it itself is not a terrible game. It's not a great game, but it's not terrible. But just the leaps and strides that Kaiserreich has made over it leave it just dwarfed in comparison. And there are just so many things that Vanilla could have done and should have done by now that they just haven't. Its development in the last year has quite simply been a travesty. How are you starting to push in over here? Yeah, I'm not sure. Is that your capital? Oh wow, your capital is miles away. Well, that's annoying. Okay, so the blues have arrived. Huzzah! Let's start you marching. Uh, I'm going to grab as much of this territory, honestly, as we possibly can. So that we can grab as much of this northern area before Grant, uh, Grant, France steals it all. You guys are on the march. That's fine. Got one more unit coming in. And then you two training. You are ready. Um... Let's just go ahead and sign you. To that, off you go. Well, I know that uh, Paradox supports Kaiserreich because at the uh, Paradox Con, the Kaiserreich team was there and they were brought in, I think, at Paradox's expense for like flights and hotels and stuff. I think, I'm not 100% sure. Send your Mozambique units to the capital. I withdrew Mozambique completely. Oh, uh oh. The Ottomans made peace with everyone. That does not bode well. No, nope, they lost. Horribly. Because I want them to take Mozambique. So that I can get the actual proper monarchy. I don't know if it counts... Ownership. I think ownership is something lost in a war and I don't particularly want to lose the war. Russia declared war on Azerbaijan. Easily beating that off. You guys are still marching through. Uh, one of you. The one who has moved less far. That would be you. You go there. You're still in training. How long until you're done? Away a while yet. That's fine. How have you lost so much? Oh, right, you're a militia unit. That's fine. kind of curious to see what their combat strength is. Good defense, but I have good attack because of all of my artillery, so it does kind of balance out. Does Germany send volunteers to this? I think they're actually blocked from doing that, so no. In the same way that Germany is blocked from intervening in Baltics. Yeah, once you win the war, then I think they can do stuff. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah, Germany is at war. So, no. There is nothing they can do. How's the contribution? Mine's 40%. French is 60%. Come on! More war score! Let's do this! I need to lose more stuff. <laughs> Baratia declared war on Bhutan. So be it. 
You're on your way over there. You're doing your thing over there. You've taken that. Marvellous. Um, how much are these ones actually worth? One, 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 three, five, one, one, three. So I kind of need to run along here. Right, this is when I really wish I had some cavalry or something just so I could race along here and beat the French to it. Not sure that's going to happen though. I don't think a naval invasion would help. What are you two doing? Uh, quite frankly, I would like you to run. You don't need to arrive there with much at all. In fact, I'm going to just go ahead, attack, and do so aggressively. That means you attack. And same thing. Attack aggressively. A bunch of rubbish cavalry units would have been wonderful. Aha! Military factories! Marvellous! Uh, more guns. Probably, yeah. And I'm actually very tempted to go into the division designer and create a cavalry unit. Just a really weak cavalry unit. Maybe something like this. Just so you're super, super quickly. I'm not going to give you any other things. I mean, eventually I'll continue into military police if I need to. But that will at least give me a little bit more leeway. And I want you to receive priority. Computing machine. Extra research. Excellent. It is still 38. I think I'm going to take the decryption and the encryption. I'm actually really pleased with the extent of research I'm getting. Would have raised up division count to send volunteers to the Carlist. Yeah, that's true. It would have been nice. And yes, also true. They wouldn't have needed it, but yes, it would have been nice. Focus bypass. Protect Mozambique. Ah. 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 So what exactly did that mean? It just meant that I lost out on three free for land forts. Although it also meant that I didn't need to research it, but then I wouldn't have needed to anyway. Canadian troops are arriving in my territory. That's nice. And you are still on the march. Grab all the land you can, because if the Entente forces arrive in my land and push out, they're actually taking land for me. Which would be nice. How much manpower does Portugal have? 28,000. Although that is only on volunteer only. I haven't needed to boost it up and I probably won't for a while. I'm currently losing. Why? Oh, low popularity. Occupations. I do need to do something about that. Manage occupied states. I'm going to go with gentlist because I don't really want to pay any political power for this. I don't really want their resources because there won't be any. Any KR countries I want to play in the future? Yes. Oh, you cheeky bastards. Really? Oh, way to just naval invade the really important stuff. Uh, October 38. Still not close enough. Still can't get you. May as well research recon companies. Although I could get the um, naval doctrine. Yeah, there are a lot of countries I want to play. Like one of the main ones, Switzerland and Thailand are probably top of the list at the moment. Poland would be pretty high up. Redoing Germany would be pretty high up. Bahratia took two states. Like, how close is this war? It's already half done. French Empire still is the most. It kind of looks like I will be dividing this land between us and France. Their al-Salam is worth 10 points. So doing a charge over there would kind of make sense. Defeat in Africa! The Middle Africans... What? No, they haven't. The Middle Africans have defeated our forces in Africa. It may be time for us to surrender our colonies now. Let us see what it is Middle Africa wants out of this war. That's bullshit. I'm thrashing them. This tells the whole bloody story. <sighs> yeah, 
Yeah, lots of new icons are added. I think it's not so much that I've lost as I haven't won yet that event. Middle Africa surrenders. It was a ploy. I understand now. They were saying, ah, we've beaten you. The German weakling have de been defeated by our glorious armies. We have finally avenged 1918 and can establish the pink map vision of our greatest minds have had for a long time. Demand Vorbeck's land and Nissan land. This is the start of the great new Portuguese empire. And we make peace. A burr. That didn't do anything. Unless it's midnight. No, apparently that did nothing. So that's just a weird event that fired for no reason. I suspect bugs. Oh wait, no, I gained this area. I hadn't actually conquered that. But it didn't make peace. We're still at war. Oh wait, their armies disappeared. The armies over here did. What's going on here? I am confused. Okay. Can I do the king focus? I couldn't previously. I doubt I can. Nope. It looks like it's got to be the organic kingdom. Uh, right, that gives me more troops. Excellent. Now I can get Angola Inosa, which allows me to grab these ones. And that is quite powerful. Wow. Two hundred political power, national spirit, African triumph. You know what? I'm going to grab these because I want the political power so that I can get the um, economy laws done. Angola is ours, and we will shout. It's meat and blood. With no hesitation, we defend and fight until we win, for Angola is ours. Huzzah! And they have successfully taken basically, yeah, all of the victory points in that area, giving them 51% war score. Great. Alright. Uh, let's just tell you guys to just take that. Go. And are we pushing south here? Why are you both going to the same place? That's just silly. Don't go to the same place. In fact, go there. And then there. And then there. And then you. Go here. Then here. Then here. And then here. Meanwhile, you go there. Then there. There, there, there. There we are. Simples. Embark the cavalry while it's still green. Haven't even recruited it yet. Oh, what we do have, though, is the... Oh, wow. We got three of them. Oh, sweet. Seriously? Yep. Seriously. So it did recreate the guard units in case we deleted them, but we hadn't. So we gained three fully upgraded guard units. Well, not fully upgraded, but fully equipped guard units for free. That's pretty sweet. Whoops. Well, I'll add you to that list, and we will have you put in the thingy. Can I do the focus now that I've lost it all? No, because I think you need to lose it in the peace deal. You need to lose that war, is basically what that's saying. It's the revanchist option, even though it looks like it shouldn't be. And we're down to low stability again by two points. Uh. 
Everton. Yeah, France is absolutely gobbling that area up. So it looks like France is going to get West Africa while we get South and Central. I'm I'm okay with this. I get oh I get some more tungsten, and basically nothing else. And there we go. War is over. They've already taken that section. In which case, I think I'm going to... Oh, wow, that's actually really expensive. Seventy-seven points. Yeah, maybe not for that one. I'm just going for the cheap bits. And so long as they don't have a border on it, I don't think they'll take it. So we're going to take this. Can we grab that? We can't. I'm going to end my turn there. Grab that. End turn. They're just grabbing that bit. That's fine. And so long as I can grab the coast. No! How did you... What? I didn't press... No, I didn't press done. How do you take all of that? You didn't even occupy this, so this should have been super expensive. How? Yeah, I'm going to reload that. <laughs> that was bullshit. It's only four days. I suspect it's because France passed gave all of their points to Canada, and then Canada somehow got a billion points because the way the passing system works sometimes is rubbish. Uh, Germany can still run to Vietnam. And Indonesia. Uh, no, I'm not giving you guys thingies. Right, so you've already taken this area. Fine. I'm going to do exactly the same thing that I did just then. And try and block you. Like. I seem to have less points this time. How has the Communion of France got points in this? What? Oh, because they're at war with Germany, I guess. You took that coast already. What? One more time. <sighs> you can gain war score via console. How? Because, yes, I'm going to do that. In fact, hold on. Saving game. Please wait. I'm going to save that, and there is a mod which allows you to just do the peace deal with your bloody self, and I'm going to do that, because this is ridiculous. All right, uh, let me find that mod. Peace. Conference? Uh, con play, a, play a piece. I think it's called play a piece. Player-led peace conferences, that's the one. Uh, do, 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 do. Will this work with mods? I'm going to try 
If this screws everything up, then it screws everything up. And I will uninstall it again. Copyright is just too much of a problem. Right, so we are back again. Um, do, 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 do. Peace should happen soon. And I now have the player-led peace conferences mod installed so I can do it myself. All right, so Canada is going to pass. India is going to pass. Portugal is not going to pass. Portugal is going to take the area that they have won. I'm going to do this fairly. I'm going to take that bit. I'm going to take that bit. Oh, I screwed up already. Why is the French Empire not getting any? Yeah, I've screwed up already. <sighs> I need to get used to how this system works. Yeah, other nations give you all their points automatically, so I need to make sure I have the right flag selected. That's on me. Like, I knew how it worked. Alright, start that again. Because I was giving myself too many points, so it shouldn't have worked that way. That was my fault. Come on. Win the war. Let's do it. There we are. So, Commonwealth of Canada is going to give their points to France. Pass. India is giving their points to France. Pass. Except they don't seem to be. Why am I getting all the points? I clearly did not have myself selected. Alright, it's fine. I can I can still do this. So I'm taking these bits. I'm taking that bit. End turn. I'm then going to select the proper France, you. I'm going to give you that, and that, and that, and that, and that, and that, and that, not that. And then I'm going to select myself again. Pass, 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 pass. I'm going to give myself those bits. And I'm going to give you these bits. Oh, wait, that's way too much. And I'm going to give myself these bits. And then I'm going to give you those bits. Except for the bit that's costing like 300 points for whatever reason. Oh, you're saying that I actually took Cameroon. Okay. Um, 